Next up, this looks sloppy. Hold on. It's still going to look sloppy. It's just four or five giant boxes. High-end beef mixer number 13. I really don't know. I think there used to be in both, but now lately I've heard it's terrible for both of those. Um, so we got a beef box, NT17, Dynasty, Leaf Greatest Hits, and the Flawless First Off the Line. Five monstrous boxes. There are your teams. There are combos. JMVB, you have Twins Rays. JB, Diamondbacks Reds. It's JB's first break and he gets Diamondbacks Reds. Jeez, hopefully there's some Reds or something. Sorry. Marby, Royals Brewers. New guys getting combos. UCCF, Rockies Marlins. Bibio, Blue Jays, Padres. Those are the five combos. Yeah, I think they're just, they've made like too much of Pokemon and magic from what I understand now and they're just like not worth anything. Alright, we're going to start with NT. Didn't the Reds kill this break the first time? Am I thinking of something else? I thought the Reds did really good. Because we've done this break. We did it last week. I don't know. I just heard that Pokemon and magic are not doing well lately. It used to be awesome. All right, Jordan Montgomery to 99 to start for the Yankees. Oops, hold on. We have Dustin Pedroia timeline to 25. Who's got the Yankees? T Dog. Winner win is Red Sox. Winner winner, your Red Sox. Weird. Stanton patch to 10. Didn't we have the same thing? Oh, it was a timeline patch. There's a combo spot, UCCF, your Marlins. Underneath that, Heine Grow. There's a Reds card to 99. A redemption for Dansby Swanson. Rookie material signatures. UCCF's Braves. Jose De Leon to 99 for the race. Triple Relic Auto. GMBBB's combo. And a Carl Edwards Jr. Six swatch signatures to 25. All patchy. T Dog. We have. There you go. Frank Thomas to 25, a six swatch signature. Worm. And Ralph Kiner, Legends Cuts for Pittsburgh, four of five. Quad bat relic in there. T Dog. Two gray, yeah. Well, a booklet to five. Ralph Kiner. What did we do next? I'm trying to remember. What order we did these in? Probably flawless? I'll do flawless. Let me stack these over here real quick. Which break's gonna fill first? Or either break's gonna fill the bonus breaks tonight? I don't know. I can't see. See how many spots are left. Are they close? Oops. Oh, that's not good. All these boxes are entirely too large. Oh, Bowman's down to one. Uh, where's my little thingies? Don't want to spoil the surprise. Okay. We start with, as you saw, 25 Manny Margot, dual patch auto. Bibby, that's a combo spot hit for the Padres. We have David Dahl, patch auto, one of 20. Red Ruby. Another one, UCCF, Rockies and Marlins combo. Under that, Corey Seager, dual patch, 10 of 10. Toast Malone, your Dodgers. 
a Elston Howard for the Yankees, 19 of 20. Ruby pa or Ruby Relic, anyway, T-Dog. And Jason Giambi, USA card, 15 of 15. Which team did Giambi play the most years for? A's? A's more than Yankees? Seems like he played for the A's for a while. I can't remember. To look it up. And Turner and Naquin going to the Nationals to 25. Spaghetti. Oh, Oakland, huh? Giambi going to the A's. If we have a card that has no team on it like that, it goes my rules and my frequently asked questions. We go to the team they played the most viewers for. Some people do the last team they played for, which I don't like because then you'd have like Brett Favre on the Jets or Vikings or whatever. And there's a lot of guys that play forever on one team and then they go to some crappy team like Emmett Smith on the Cardinals. Like, why would you do that? I don't know. I think that's the best way. Eloy Jimenez to 25. It, it's the Cubs still. T-Dog. Did he play the Indian on the Indians last? Yeah. That just doesn't seem right. Nolan Arenado, 10 of 10. Flawless finishes. That's a sweet Arenado. Look at the Rockies, UCCF. Yeah, Jeter's always been on the A's. We all know that. The last card from the box. Three of three on Toronto. Oh, win a winner's like rip off. Look at Bibby, another combo spot hit. Roger Clemens, three of three on Toronto. Wow. Sneaky. Willie Mays on the Mets. <laughs> well, there wouldn't be a vintage. Uh, that looks like a relic auto. No, I guess the, the auto's over here. All right, we'll go here then. First. Jewel card, Babe Ruth, three of three. That's the first off the line purple. D Dog, Ruth on the Braves. We got Pedro on the Phillies. I don't know how, how anyone would do that rule. And a Dansby to 15 for the Braves. Ruby, UCCF. That Ruth is pretty nice. The auto, auto relic. Is that Ken? No, Cano? No, Judge. Oh my gosh. 9 of 20, Aaron Judge, dual patch auto. T Dog. Jerry Rice on the Seahawks. That's a nice Judge. Sweet Judgey. All right, I'm gonna do Dynasty next. Martin Monk on the Eagles. What's the worst one ever? I th I don't know. Emmett Smith on the Cardinals is pretty bad. Although he had some decent years there, I guess at least. All right, Dynasty. Hmm, I wonder who that could be. Jeff Bagwell. Oh, I actually thought it was Diamondbacks. Jeff Bagwell, 7 of 10. <laughs> I was wrong. TKT, your Houston Astros. Thought it was going to be a uh, Goldie. Yeah, Wade Boggs on the Rays. That's true. Greatest Heats. Oh, Utah and OKC is right now, yeah. That's Thunder. Elijah one on the Raptors? Jeez, I don't even remember that. All right, <clears throat> we start with the buyback of Dan Gladden. And then we really start with a Ryan Sandberg, 83 tops Beckett authenticated autograph. T 
T-Dog. Greg and T-Dog. Marty Brodeur on the Bulls. Rhino. Under that. Oh, going to the Dodgers. Toast Malone snakes it away from T-Dog. A Seeger Schwarber, 2 of 10. 9-5 from Flawless. An extra Flawless hit. This one's a 9-5. Looks like a definitive. No, it's a framed museum. Greg Maddox, 1 of 15, UCCF for your Braves. Two thousand fourteen. Oh man. And friggin' T Dog again. Sixty two tops Clemente seven. Yeah, Jordan on the Wizards. How could we forget that? It's cool. Clemente nineteen sixty two. PSA 7. Alright, let's see if the beef can hold a candle to that. 7.20. A top... 9-5? What is this? Oh, Jonathan Gray, 9-5 Bowman Draft, first auto from 13. <laughs> Rockies beef. More Rockies. Yeah, Jonathan Gray. He's solid. Rock is hard to find good Rockies beef. We have... Oh, yeah. This one's weird. This is a recollection collection. 87 Donners signed Tom Seaver for the Red Sox. Winna winna. It's numbered to 60. This is a weird card. Hard to find Red Sox. Oh, wait, no, it's not. I don't know why. I, I, I don't know where this card came from. Isn't that weird? And... Nolan Ryan, numbered 3 of 34, 2013 Memories Buyback Autograph, UCCF. Ninety-one Leaf. It's cool. This is a weird beef box. Looks like PSA <clears throat> for the Cardinals. Oh, remember when the Cardinals hit everything last week and now they're not getting anything? A 1968, look at the grade, Mint 9, Lou Brock. It's a nicely graded card. Ninety one Leaf, yeah, I never did. Is this one of the big hits? No, there's only three boxes left. There is one monster left. This might be it. Oh, this is not it, but this is pretty good. Not the monster I was thinking of, but how about a Trout 11 update rookie? I don't know why it's not graded, but it's not. Notorious B.O.B. Trout 11 update rookie. All right. <laughs> More beef. <laughs> 